Hello, today we're talking about commercial real estate related marketing for 2023. So I'm gonna start with three marketing tips, but I'm also gonna give you three tactical marketing tips. Tip number one, know holistically the customer journey. If you don't understand each and every touch point that a potential lead is making across all of your different marketing efforts, how are you gonna best market to them? Number two, focus on value-driven marketing. What I mean by this is in each and every post that you're putting out, try to incorporate value in your post. Just don't say, hey, I have a new listing. That's gonna get old really fast. So the more that you can provide value, people are going to continue to come back to look to you as a resource. So say you're a brokerage company, you're targeting landlords. Maybe you wanna put out more marketing reports, things like that. Maybe if you're a landlord and you're targeting retailers, you wanna to put together something like an article or blog post that says how to market your business after the holiday rush. And number three, up your customer service game. Okay, people are sick and tired of calling your offices and getting a voicemail and not getting a call for two or three days. You have to figure out these processes to include a better customer service. Also, think about about your website when did you last update it what needs to be updated to make it a more user-friendly experience so that people can get to exactly what they're looking for okay now let's talk actual marketing tactics number one we're talking video right you're here watching this video right now video has been a huge marketing tool the past couple of years particularly Short form video is definitely a place that you wanna focus as well as incorporating micro influencers. By micro influencers, I mean 10,000 followers or less. This helps you be super hyper local. My second tactical marketing tip for commercial real estate related businesses is create a LinkedIn strategy. LinkedIn has been huge too the last year, two years. A lot of people have jumped back on the platform and have been super, super engaged with it. Figure out a posting schedule. Think about what articles you can post and don't just post those articles, but show your value and knowledge expertise. Include at least three sentences to a small paragraph on your point of view about those articles. My third tip is community-driven networking. We've all been locked up with the pandemic or sick of Zoom meetings. It's time to get back out there. So reach back out to those Chamber of Commerces and other local targeted um, organizations that you can get involved in. A lot of times, you can only get so far with digital marketing and it's time to get back out there in person meeting with people and by doing that you're going to make a greater impression on someone and hopefully continue that relationship over time and if you need any help implementing any of these marketing tactics or maybe you just need someone looking over your marketing budget for 2023 give me a call